Brown tree snakes have a unique behavior that allows them to climb very large, smooth, cylindrical surfaces. For this unique type of limbless locomotion, the shape of the snake resembles a lasso as a loop of the body completely encircles the cylinder while it wiggles its way uphill. The anterior part of the snake points uphill and it does not contribute to propulsion. As the snake leaves the ground, it encircles the cylinder and then the body crosses over itself. The configuration of the crossover region is highly variable and often varies as the snake proceeds to climb. The belly of the snake contacts the cylinder and small sideways bends control the tension within the loop. These small lateral bends propagate posteriorly within the loop of the lasso and the movement of each such bend provides the propulsive mechanism. Because each lateral bend within the loop is so small, each cycle of movement has a very small amount of upward displacement. All previously described climbing behaviors of snakes on steep, smooth cylinders involve some type of concertina locomotion, during which some parts of the body have static contact for gripping, while other parts have sliding contact. Furthermore, the head-to-tail distance changes substantially as different regions of the snake periodically bunch up and then extend. Most commonly, arboreal concertina involves bending the body to the left and right and using ventral flexion to grip the cylinder, and brown tree snakes use this generalized behavior on small and intermediate diameter cylinders. As cylinder diameter increases, reticulated pythons sometimes use helical wrapping to grip the cylinder. During concertina locomotion, the snakes transiently form an uphill grip while maintaining a downhill grip whereas the snakes always have only one gripping region during lasso locomotion. By tensioning the loop with lateral bending, brown tree snakes can use more muscles than those that are available for ventral flexion. The frequent pausing during lasso locomotion suggests that it is physiologically very demanding. To conclude, this unique locomotion allows brown tree snakes to climb larger cylinders than does concertina locomotion and acquire resources that might otherwise be unobtainable, such as those in smooth-barked trees.